Hello, Jeannie Lynch here. Thank you for either stumbling upon or subscribing to or clicking into my YouTube channel. It's Mean Jean 1963 and I appreciate you being here today and hearing what I have to say. So I have some, uh, I have some favors. So if you could either share this, subscribe to my video, or give me some feedback, that would be great. I'm getting lots of requests to do more of these videos, um, either answering questions or telling stories. So today I thought I would, you know, only in YouTube land can it be up to you. So I was hoping you could give me some feedback um, as to what you would like to see in the future. So today I thought I would give an example of a story. Um, I have an arsenal of stories that I could share and um, maybe you could help me make a decision. So anyway, today's story is this. Um, when people come to me, they're usually, you know, they come from referrals, they come from um, people I've worked with in the past, and if you're one of those people, thank you. Um, thank you for trusting me. Uh, they come to me and they're usually in a really dark place, right? They just have suffered a loss, going through divorce, not happy in the job. I mean, we'll call it the shadow, right? They're, they're surrounded by the dark. And they're coming to me because they want help through that process and they don't want to be there. And when people are in that space, um, I know this is going to sound a little strange, but there's a part of me that is a little envious or a little jealous. And I know that sounds weird to hear, but hear me out. The reason is I know what I know. I know that their journey has just begun. And I look to my own life and I think of the times that I've gone through those dark places and I think of where I am today and it is that true journey that uh, has led us through where we are So, in the struggles. So I thought I'd share a story today that kind of um, is a great metaphor for that work that I do. So here's the story. I'm sure you've heard this before, but I just, I think it's so, Profound. So there's this gentleman, he gets up in the morning and he goes out every morning to the sacred place and he has his coffee and reads his paper. And on this one particular day, in this moment, he looks over and he notices this monarch butterfly just in its beginning stages of coming out of its uh, cocoon. And it's struggling and one wing's out, the other one's jammed in and you know he's watching this and 15 minutes go by and he gets it in his head that maybe he can help. So he runs in and he grabs the most delicate instruments that he could find. I think it was his uh, wife's tweezers and his mustache cutters and he came back out and together this insect and this beautiful monarch um, and him worked together to uh, free itself. And uh, he did a great job. It was free. And out it goes, and out it takes on its flight. And as he sat back down, he turned around and he witnessed the monarch fall to the ground and die. Of course, being the compassionate man that he was, he went inside and started to research it online. And here's what he found out. He actually found out that it was the struggle that was nature's design to help the butterfly in its true flight. That the mere pumping and pulling of its wing out of its cocoon allowed the blood to get into its wing to sustain itself for flight. So I think about that, and I think of that in a metaphor for this work, and um, how important it is to you know, not cut someone free when they come to you in that place, but to really just honor where they are in their process and help them through it. And sometimes it could just be witnessing it and so if you know anybody today that would benefit from hearing that, maybe is going through their own shadow at this time, I encourage you to send this video on. Um, that would be really helpful and part of why I'm doing this work. So thank you for that. And again, that's kind of an idea. Um, it's kind of what I'm looking for is just some feedback and subscribe, share. That would be great. And let me know if this is uh, something you'd like to see more of. So it's Gina Lynch. Again, subscribe to my videos, Mean Gene 1963. Comment on Facebook. It's probably where I'm going to put it up. And have a great day. Thank you. I appreciate you and namaste.